To complete the reactions from names and balance them, you're going to use skills that you used in previous units to write formulas given names. For example, sodium is Na. Diatomic chlorine, remember Brinkelhoff? Cl2. And I'm going to copy that plus sign down here to show that they're two separate items. Then we have the arrow and sodium chloride. Well, sodium is Na, chloride is Cl. Sodium has a plus one charge, chloride has a minus one charge. So the formula is NaCl. Let's balance it. One Na, one Na. Two Cl's, one Cl. Now we have to revise two Na's, two Na's. Let's just double check. Two sodiums, two sodiums, two chlorines, two chlorines. If you find that you can't balance your reaction, many times it's because the formula is not correctly written. So you just want to go back and double check that. Aluminum is Al. Just call me Al. Plus copper. Two means that the charge of the copper is plus two. Not that there are two coppers. Plus two because copper's got more than one charge listed. Sulfate, according to table F, is SO4 with a minus two charge. Plus two and minus two cancel each other out. Great, that's the formula. Arrow. Aluminum is plus three. Sulfate is SO4, we already said is minus 2. 3 times 2 is 6. So we need 2 aluminums to make plus 6, and we need 3 sulfates to make minus 6. Plus copper, which is not a Brinkelhoff, so I don't make it Cu2. Let's balance it. 1 aluminum, 2 aluminums. Put a 2 in front. 1 copper, 1 copper. Okay, for now. One sulfate, remember if there's no parentheses, that means there's only one of them. Three sulfates, put a three in front. Do we have to revise? Yes, we put a three in front of the copper, we need to put a three in front of that copper. Two aluminums, two aluminums, three coppers, three coppers, three sulfates, three sulfates. If you had not written this formula correctly, you would have been unable to properly balance this reaction. So it's an excellent check.